hey guys welcome to my channel if it's your first time here hi 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 welcome to my channel so in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys basic skincare for dark skin head to toe skincare for dark skin so if that's what you're interested in please do keep on watching So as a dark skin, you need to go for something plain, not lightening, not whitening. The best you can do is to go for something brightening. That's if you must. Or just go for something plain that just moisturizes your skin. Something that moisturizes your skin and glow your skin. You don't need whitening, you don't need lightening. So I'll be sharing with you some um, skincare and then I'll be sharing at least two examples of this skincare. So if I'm talking about bath soap i will give as up of two bath soaps you can use as dark skin i hope you understand that just in case you cannot find one of one of the recommended products around your vicinity so i'm going to start with the face as a dark skin you need cleansers you need cleansers even if you are acne prone skin or not no matter your skin type you need to use facial cleansers you need to cleanse your skin always to get rid of the dirt on your skin so for a, for dry skin that's like if a dark skin lady or guy that is dry that has dry skin one thing you need to get is non-foaming cleansers if you have a dry skin get a non-foaming cleansers so i have two recommendations for non-foaming cleansers you can get for dark dry skin uh, which is the CeraVe hydrating cleanser very good for dark skin and also good for dry skin oh there's this other one i'll put it on the screen i have never been able to pronounce that um, product so please i'll put it on the screen so you see it is a very good um hydrating cleanser for dry skin is it la Poche something please let's talk about the name but it's a very good cleanser and you can get it in most places and it's very good for dry skin so next for oily and combination skin you need to get foaming cleanser Remember for dry skin, you don't need, uh, we need a non-foaming cleanser. For dry, uh, for oily and combination skin, you need foaming cleanser. So we have foaming cleansers like the CeraVe foaming cleanser as well. This will help you get rid of excess oil and also get rid of dirt on your skin. And also the Cetaphil foaming cleanser for oily skin, the CeraVe foaming cleanser or the Cetaphil foaming cleanser. You can get any of these cleansers if you have oily skin and you're dark. So next we move to face toner. You need toners as well. No matter your skin type, you need toner. For a dark skin, if you don't have acne or you don't have any skin issue or anything, you can go for the simple sorting face toner. If you don't have any skin issue, just go for this toner. It's a very good toner and it will help your skin as well. Or just go for rose water. Rose water is also a very good face toner. But if you have acne prone skin, I have a full video for acne prone toners for acne prone skin. You can check that out. So those are like two recommendations, which is a simple toner, simple toner, or you can use rose water as your toner. Next is face serum. Dark skin, you can use face serum as well. I know there are so many uh, face serum out there and most of them are lightening and whitening and the rest. This is where you can be excused to use brightening face serum. I have two recommendations for face serum. You can either get the Neutrogena Boost um, Bright Illuminating Face Serum or the Pimai Face Serum. These are like two good face serums that I've tried and are very good for my skin as a dark skin. So you can check either of these two serums. They are very good and would also moisturize your skin. The Neutrogena or Pimai face serum. So we are still on the face. The next I recommend is facial moisturizer. I also have a full video from facial moisturizer for all skin types. If you go check that out as well, if you if this um, recommendation, this one I'll be recommending is not enough for you. I think I mentioned like five in that video, but I'll just recommend two here. So we have the Neutrogena Hydro Boost um, face serum moisturizer that's a very good moisturizer for dark skin does the job and very nice for dark skin or you can try the cetaphil moisturizing cream that's a very good moisturizer so i will not brighten you or anything and it still does the job as well so lastly we are going to do sunscreen sunscreen for dark skin i have a video for sunscreen that does not leave white cast i'm giving you these options as well because in case these ones i'm recommending or uh, you can't find them in your vicinity I have a video where I mentioned at least five of these products in the video. They are, they are specially dedicated for sunscreen, um, toner, and the rest. But for this video, I'm just recommending two. So the two products I'm recommending for sunscreen is the Black Girl Sunscreen. These are sunscreen that will leave no white cast. As a dark skin, applying sunscreen that will leave white cast on you is a no-no. It just gives this 
Oh, did you? Um, it gives this clown look. So you need to get sunscreen that will leave no white cast. So the first one I would recommend would be the black girl sunscreen. That's like highly recommended for dark skin. Or the Nivea Protect and Moisture Sunscreen. That's a very good um, sunscreen for dark skin. And that one is quite economical. It's big. So it's these are like two very good sunscreens for dark skin. Skin. So moving on, we are going to talk about full body now. We're done with your face. These are like basic things, simple things, affordable things you can do with your face. Moving on is to your body. So I'll start with the body scrub as a dark skin comb. Sis, bro, let's have this conversation. You need to scrub your skin. You need to exfoliate your skin. Most people see dark skin as dirty, as um, not well nourished skin and the rest. But scrubbing your skin will help you glow. For all the things I, I will be recommending in this video, if you don't scrub your skin, if you don't exfoliate your skin, you might not see the results because the exfoliating basically helps get rid of dead skin cells. So if you're exfoliating your skin, it will help your skin a lot. So please guys, exfoliate your skin. So I recommend two scrubs you can use to exfoliate your skin as a dark skin lady or man. The first will be the coconut coffee body and uh, face and body scrub. I'll leave a picture on the screen. This is like one of my best body scrubs out there. It's very nice for dark skin. So try this or you try the dough brown sugar body scrub. These two body scrubs are everything. They do the job and are perfect. Perfect. When I mean perfect, they are perfect for dark skin. So try out any of these body scrubs, any of these two body scrubs I've recommended. Or you check out my body scrub. Next, we move to body wash or bar soap. For some people, they do body wash, for some people, they do bar soap. For body wash, I would recommend the Dove Purely Pumpkin Shea Butter and Vanilla Body Wash. That's a very good and perfect body wash for dark skin. Or the bar soap. It has the same bar soap. Any of the two is very good for dark skin. Or you can also go for the Ambi Bar Soap. That's also a good body bar soap for dark skin any of these to do or am. next is body lotion your body lotion needs to be a moisturizing lotion as a dark skin after doing all of this after scrubbing um getting a good body wash or a good um soap bar and then you don't moisturize your skin so everything will just be off so you need a good moisturizing cream so one body lotion I recommend is the Palmer's body lotion. The Palmer's body lotion is a very good body lotion for dark skin. And the Vaseline Coco Radiant body lotion. You see these two? The Vaseline Coco Radiant is very nice. Very, very, very nice. It's really moisturizes the skin and also give you that hot chocolate skin you want and for, for your dark skin. Getting it right with your bath so getting it right with your body scrub. Just top it up with your Vaseline Coco Radiant, then you're good to go. Moisturizes give you that glow, perfect for dark skin. Moving next to body oil, you need body oil as well. Not being moisturized as a dark skin is a no no, so you also need body oil. One of the body oil I also recommend is the Vaseline Coco Radiant Body Oil. Sweet body oil, nice body oil, all the good names you can attach to this body oil. It deserves it. It's a very good body oil, Vaseline Coco Radiant Body Oil, all the bio oil. Bio oil is another good body oil for all skin types. Nice body oil keeps you moisturized, keeps you looking good, glowing, and the rest. So these are like all the body essentials, head to toe. I would recommend for any dark skin lady. Any other thing you want to add, your fragrance and the rest is based on what you want. And but these are like body essentials you need for dark skin head to toe if i miss anything or you have any other question please leave it in the comment section i will do well to answer i will be able to respond we've come to the end of today's video thank you so much for watching thank you so so much please don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye